Hi, everybody. Hello there. I'm Jerry. And I'm Linda. We're the newcomers. We have a show today. I think if you're one of our followers, you're really going to love. We're going back memory lane. Memory lane. I love that. How far back? <laughs> <laughs> We're going back more than five years. Okay. We're going back to our lifestyle visit. Uh, it was October, wasn't it? October of 2018. That's right. We knew virtually nothing about the villages. We were, in fact, going to... Uh, Go to a visit. Where was it? Uh, Stonecrest in Ocala. Stone Creek, Oak Creek. in Ocala. <laughs> and we had made arrangements. We already had it set up. And I started reading about the villages, and it just seemed like a great place. So we changed our visit from Stone Creek to come to the villages. And we did a four-day lifestyle visit, and we caught it on film. And I lost the files somewhere along the way, but I found them. Yay. So I wanted to bring it to you because it's really kind of ridiculous because... <laughs> I'm going to tell you right now. You've heard me scold you many times about holding that camera landscape. I filmed almost all of this in, in portrait. portrait. I didn't know any better. Uh -huh. These were videos we took for our children. Mm -hmm. We were going to show them this new place that we were visiting at the time. Right. It wasn't even, we didn't no. even really anticipate moving. No, no, we were just visiting. So this is going to be interesting. And she's, you're going to see her driving all over in golf cart because <laughs> I was the one taking the pictures. All right. So you can blame me for this photography. <laughs> Again, no microphones, no lighting, no nothing. Mm -hmm. Just a personal home video of our lifestyle stay. I hope you like it. There she is. We <laughs> stayed in Alden bungalows. You'll see it a little bit later. By the way, the light's coming in and out of us because the sun is uh, getting blocked by clouds. So a picture may not be the greatest. Look at that. I've always put her up on a pedestal. <laughs> I was just wondering what that cute little place was. People say she's the luckiest woman on earth, but I don't know about that. Here she goes. In the villages, look who my driver is. We're driving. This is an incredible place. Look at this. Tunnels. Golf carts rule down here. Everywhere we go, we're taking golf carts. I like this riding in the passenger seat business. We'll stop. Look both ways. Here we go across the street. Very nice. Recreation Center. Going by the Recreation Center. They're playing shuffleboard today. This is great. Driver, we're in the villages. Riding on a golf cart trail. You get everywhere by golf cart down here. We've got a nice one, a gas-powered Yamaha. Linda's doing really well. All these beautiful homes on the golf courses and on these little neighborhoods down here. Lovely place. Linda's becoming a <laughs> really good golf cart driver. we got to get us one of these. She's going to stop and make sure that no cars are coming. They're not. She's going to go right across. Very nice. We ran a stop sign there, but it's no problems. Big Mama still driving. Getting ready to go through a tunnel. These tunnels go under all the major roads. This is probably the first time you ever drove a golf cart. Now that is cool, isn't it? Brings us up here in this tropical paradise. Look at all these. Palm trees. We're right in a golf course right here. So we're, we're not on the course, we're just driving next to it. We're in the village. That's Turtle Mountain Golf Course. Having a great time. Wish you were here. This is Eisenhower Rec Center. You see, that's a salute to the military. Oh, yes. Oh, that's the military. That's my uncle and my uh, great my grandfather. Ping pong. I, I'm a good ping pong player. I mean, I don't know if I'm good or not. I mean, I could, I can hit the ball over the net, but yeah, I love yeah. it. I'd like to play ping pong. Yeah. A lot of the recs have pool tables. Almost all the uh, rec centers like Rohan and uh, Manatee and Captiva, mm -hmm. they have uh, pool tables. And also the meeting rooms where you can have events. Like we had one recently. What was that for? Oh, we had our village, um, uh, it was the Augusta, our golf tournament. We had a get, get gathering in Rohan, and that was a lot of fun. Right. President Eisenhower, General Eisenhower. 
That's some Ellis's in your family mm -hmm. that were military. Mm -hmm. And a lot of the rec centers have stages where they can put on productions. Like she said, we just went to uh, the wrap-up for the golf tournament and a band played on that stage and everybody could dance. Yeah. There's artwork all around, especially at Seabreeze. You love the Seabreeze. I do love the coastal. What's this, that? This is a card room where women are playing cards and games. So a lot of the rec centers have that extra room right off the kitchen area where you can have your snacks and uh, refreshments. So this is a typical room because I do this in uh, Bunko. Right. Yeah. Yesterday you played Bunko, didn't you? Mm -hmm. And more decorations. You know, it's just uh, all over. They're really remarkable. But seriously, look at these houses on this golf course. They're here. Got a cart path for these carts about the size of most county roads back <laughs> home. And over here you've got an absolutely gorgeous golf course. But there are about 20 of these golf courses within this, <laughs> the villages. A lot more than that now. Times have changed in five years. We're going to see a lot Amazing. of difference here, I think. I feel like we're in Disney World. Our driver is going to take us down into the abyss. This was amazing. Crossing under a major road again. Gotta be careful right here because other golf carts like that one are coming. But she's got it mastered. She's gonna go right here. She's gonna stop. It's a stop. And she's gonna go right. There we go. And we'll come out of the tunnel. That's how you go under all these roads down here. By the way, there's uh, about 120,000 people in the villages. Wow, and it has grown. <laughs> Lots of golf carts, about half that many golf carts, probably 60,000. Look at those live oak trees. They're great. We're gonna go right. If you go right, you can't go wrong, Linda, just remember that. Uh, Sunny's barbecue, man, it was good. We got the combination, yeah. but we had brisket, uh, pulled pork, barbecue chicken, and ribs. We split that. Linda took a little more than her fair share, but uh, it was okay. Again, over a hundred restaurants here in the villages. It's a 55 plus community. Look right here now, here's the road we just came under. Look on the other side, what a gorgeous golf course. Like I said, there are dozens of golf courses and there are at least 16 courses that are free for the members of the villages. Wish you guys were here, but uh, we'll come back later with more. Long turn, but look, we're, we're actually on a golf course now. <laughs> but I don't see anybody playing, but it is beautiful. Look at those lovely homes over there. <laughs> that could be us. <laughs> okay, we've come to the end of our road here. So we're gonna turn around and go back. <laughs> look how she turns around, like a pro. Look at that. Well done, Linda. Give us another look at these homes over here. By the way, if there were any driving violations, you saw that it was her driving and not me. <laughs> oh, yeah, I was on the golf course. I wasn't <laughs> supposed to be there. Yeah, that's a no-no. <laughs> Don't do that. <laughs> but these golf courses are everywhere. And the green grass, it was so beautiful. We These blue herons right here on the side of the road. What? Those aren't blue herons. I know. Ah. I said blue herons. Can you believe I called those blue herons? Those are sandhill cranes. We love them. Yeah. We see them every single day. Yeah. See them lots of times yeah. per day. Well, we, we've learned a lot about birds now, haven't we? <laughs> we Five have years. learned so much since this visit. <laughs> Here's where we're staying down here in the villages. Alden bungalows. What? Yeah, Alden, after one of my favorite grandchildren. And look here. <laughs> I'm uh, waiting for a ride, and look who came. My lovely bride. Are you having fun? Having a blast. Aww. All right, can I get in a ride with you? Absolutely. And we'll show them how we get to our bungalow from out here. Okay. This is pretty cool. All right, here we go. We're going to pause here because the car is coming through. Here they come. I had a lot shorter hair there. Linda weighs them through. She's pretty much <laughs> a professional golf cart driver now. We're coming through here. Now we're going to turn right. These are villa 
homes are bungalows. They're nice though. Ours is three bedrooms, about 1,800 right square feet. We have to wait. Really for cars. nice. We're gonna turn left here. There we go. Now this is not typical of the homes in the villages, but these are sort of snowbird homes, uh, smaller homes. They're all built on a slab. We're gonna take a left right here. And uh, they're very, very nice, very luxurious, roomy. We like the one we're staying in, that's for sure. And we're gonna turn right, right here at this stop. And there's our bungalow right there. Pretty cool, I'm gonna push the button and open the garage door. Linda's gonna pull this cart cart right in there, hopefully, without hitting that rental car. You can see that bungalow, and we liked it just fine. But it had a few drawbacks for us. We loved the wall, especially mm -hmm. for Gizmo. Mm -hmm. By the way, he's right here with us. That's nice. But the garage is a little yeah. small in that particular model of bungalow. Yeah. You can have one car and maybe your golf cart. you got to be careful coming in and out. Mm -hmm. But your washer and dryer was out there. It was. That was uh, very hot <laughs> when you did your laundry. <laughs> So that's how we do it down here in the villages. Don't know if we'll ever do it again or whether we'll come back or whether we're going to buy a house, but it's been a lot of fun. Uh, well, what did we know? <laughs> we don't know if we'll ever come back. We don't know if we'll ever do it again. Holy mackerel, look Holy what happened. Holy mackerel. Let's see, we were there, what, four days? There four days, four, days? Four, five days and four nights, I think. And we went to the town squares. That was amazing to us. Now we want to show you some actual listings that were for sale when we were looking. And you'll see the prices on these homes. This is Nance Run right here in the villages. It was for sale at the time we were looking. And you can see it's listed for $365,000. It's now valued on Zillow at $534,000. Wow. So... You know, that was right in our price range when we were here. We were looking about 350. Uh, I don't know why we didn't buy it, but maybe it was already sold or pending at the time. But that, uh, I went back through and looked at these and it's kind of interesting. And this is Mount Croggan Trail. I think I said that right. It was for sale at the time we were here. And the listing price on that's 360, what? 69. 369,000. Mm -hmm. It's now valued on Zillow at 534,000. Those prices jumped on those two properties. Yeah. This particular property is on Haynesville Way in the villages, and it was for sale for four hundred and twenty-nine thousand. And I just looked at that, and it is now valued at five seventy-nine. So things from the, the the four and a half years we've been here, five years for these listings, right. have gone up considerably. This is uh, San Antonio Lane, and it was listed at three nineteen, and it sold for. $439. Right, but it was listed for three nineteen back in 2018, right. and it mm -hmm. it sold uh, just recently for four hundred and thirty nine thousand. Give you an idea of what uh, three bedroom, two bath designer homes. Xanadu Loop. At Xanadu Loop, it's listed at four twenty, four hundred twenty thousand, and it is now valued. Actually, it's sold for six hundred and forty five thousand. Now, we don't know why did they make 225000 more in five years. They may have put in a pool. I don't know. Or may have upgraded or yeah. something. But, yeah. but you can see that the prices have definitely risen. This property is for sale. It's on McLean Drive, which is real popular. It's over in Collier. That's we have right. some friends that live yeah, over there. Have... This one's for sale for three eighty nine nine, And uh, back then, that was over our budget. Yeah. But that property recently has sold for four hundred and ninety. dollars in uh, 2023 and the last one we'll show you today this one is listed at 375,000 it's on wise way and it is now Zillow priced at 548,000 wise ways right up here in our neck of the woods too right over here they have a nice Christmas display over there so you can see that those are, those are the kind of houses we were looking for. We were looking in the 350 range. We ended up going home, and what happened? 
Well, we uh, a lot of a lot of these homes sold, and then we uh, started looking online again and found one that we really liked, which is this one, and uh, bought this one for. It was uh, sixty-five thousand more than our top budget, yeah. but you know we realized that to get exactly what you want, mm -hmm. it's it's the, those all, those properties were all gone by then. Two weeks later, yeah. all of those properties were pending, yeah. so they weren't available anymore. Mm -hmm. So that's it here. That's uh, what we we're looking at. That's our lifestyle visit. What do you think? Does it seem like five years? No, no, it's crazy. Yeah, uh, I I enjoyed that lifestyle visit, and here we are five years later. It's in, it's incredible. Yeah, we're we're coaching people on lifestyles and what to do and what not to do. We did not bring Gizmo, and I think that was a good move for us because, yeah. you know, we could explore more, and we did. We made the most of those days. So we had a wonderful time, yeah. and uh, that was pre-COVID, mm -hmm. um, but. The rest is history, right? Yeah, it really is. Now, we're in our first home here. You know the saying that they say you'll move three times within ah. villages. There's Gizmo. He's he's saying he doesn't want to move. Uh, <laughs> but who knows? You know, we'll just have to wait and see. We love it here. We're yeah. looking out at a beautiful view. By yeah. the way, this is where it all started, right here. Yeah. When we did our first videos for yeah, you, it was right, right, here, here, right here at this table in this lanai, right. looking at that. Yeah. So that's why we did it today. We thought it would, we'd go back in memory lane for you. Yeah. If you liked our video today, please press that like and subscribe button and share it with all your friends. Until next time. See you when you get here.